everybody, Norm over here, and we've got our buddy Ryan Hamilton in from Texas, the Fort Worth area. Correct. And Ryan is on my buddy Steve Van Zant's label, and he's buddies with James, ha uh, James Stevenson, who's like one of our good friends here from the store, and James plays with... The Alarm. Yeah, I met James on tour with The Alarm. Really great dude. Love that guy. All right, and then you're also friends with Chinner, who is Tom Petty's tech, mm -hmm. and also for the Dirty Knobs, and my buddy Jason's in a great, great band, great local band, but they won't be local for long. Yeah. And um, since Ryan loves Tom Petty so much, I figured I'd hook him up with Todd and Michael. Todd's playing a 50s J45. Ryan is playing uh, 80s D35. He's got some wear, it sounds great, plays great. And then Michael's got this Don Musser Acoustic 12, which is, in my opinion, the greatest electric uh, acoustic 12 on the planet. Just a super guitar. What do you think, Michael? Oh, beautiful. All right, that's Jeez, enough. Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> Anyhow, he's he a man me. of very few words. Todd, what do you think about that? Good. It's a stunning All example. Right. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So, uh, in a tribute to Tom, you wanted to do Listen to Your Heart, right? I do, yeah. Tom's a, a hero. and I kind of weaseled my way into the friendship with Chinner uh, through being a fan of Tom and um, just that world's been... Who isn't? You know. Right. So, uh, yeah, coming here was... I knew Tom was a big... Um, what's a good word? Uh, it's not really a, it's a friend, yeah, but he um, he was a big advocate, sorry, of, of this place and of you and and uh, well, we were old friends yeah. and, uh, and I played in the band with Ron Blair for a couple of years prior to the Heartbreakers, so uh, we have definitely connection there. So one of my favorite Tom Petty tunes, um, one of you guys, uh, yeah, take it. favorite Tom Petty tunes, Listen to Their Heart, kind of inspired by almost like uh, I Need You by George Harrison, you know, kind of has that same kind of feel. And uh, so, Ryan, um, you're out of Texas. Where do people find you on social media and all that? Yeah, so it's at the Ryan Hamilton. I did that because there's also a comedian named Ryan Hamilton, and I really wanted to one-up him on social okay. media. Mm -hmm. So the Ryan the, Hamilton? The, yeah. Uh, is that the T on your... 
out there? <laughs> no, it's for the Texas Rangers. <laughs> oh, there you go. All right. Well, I know, but I just figured I'd ask. So. <laughs> Which I got to be careful in this city. I've already had some The Texas looks. Rangers. Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Well, uh, so tell me, um, how do people find you on uh, that social media? But you're on Stevie Van Zandt's record label, right? I am, yes. Yeah, so I'm on Wicked Cool Records. Stevie's been amazing and a mentor in all the best ways. I'm very thankful. Um, so there's a record called This Is The Sound that came out this year. It's that's done well. So that record's out in the world. And yeah, Stevie's been wonderful. Um, if people don't know, he has a really great radio show called The Underground Garage on yep. Sirius XM. Uh, please tune into that if you don't already. Well, Stevie's a great guy, and uh, he's friends with Richie Sambora, who's another mm -hmm. Jersey guy, he's a buddy of mine. And my buddy Gary Talent was just in the store recently and said hello, um, bass player for the street band. So it's all family here at Norm's Red Guitars. Ryan Hamilton right here. Check it out. Check out his new record on Stevie's label. Again, the label is? Wicked Cool Records. Good name for a label. And Todd, Michael, Ryan, right here at Norm's.